This is a surprise face of the Communist Party of Russia's campaign for parliamentary elections this fall. His name is Jeff Monson, the St. Paul, Minnesota native, who's a mixed martial artist and avowed anarchist, is a big star in Russia. People, you know, say, "Well, why did you choose Russia?" And I, I say, "Well, I think Russia chose me." Now, the Communist Party hopes he can attract young voters to its cause, long seen as a haven for aging voters nostalgic for the Soviet past. Monson shot to fame in Russia when he was defeated by local hero Fyodor Emelianenko in 2011. The next day, President Vladimir Putin called him in his hotel room to congratulate him for showing spirit. Russians love a fighter with heart, but Monson is even more popular for his bashing of his home country and love of Russia. I have the Russian soul, and um, for better or for worse, I, this is the place I should be. Monson gets mobbed on the street wherever he walks and spends hours posing for photographs. He's been on the Russian version of Dancing with Stars, appeared on talk shows and visited towns across the country to compete and train fighters. In recent months, he's been front and center of a push by the Communist Party to refresh its appeal. He's made several appearances with Gennady Zyuganov, the party's longtime leader, including laying flowers at Lenin's mausoleum. He's also appeared in a flashy promotional video. He and the party are planning to open mixed martial arts schools for underprivileged children across the country. He still lives in the US, but travels to Russia frequently. He's applied for Russian citizenship and is in the very early stages of trying to learn the language. As part of efforts to broaden their appeal, the communists have also given Bolshevik leader Vladimir Lenin a makeover. Posters and campaign pamphlets depict Lenin in jeans and sneakers and Karl Marx in a leather jacket declaring, I'll be back. The images brought derision from a rival communist faction which said they desecrated Lenin's image. Russia will vote on September the 18th and the Communist Party is running second in polls. But, with or without Monson's help, is not a serious challenger to Putin's party.